Hello and welcome to Neil's Spanish Flybox. If you're a new viewer to the channel, you're very welcome. And if you're a returning viewer, it's great to see you back again. We're going to continue with the Perdigon theme. And today we're going to tie the Butano. Now, this Butano uh, Perdigon gets its name from the butane gas uh, that many people use in Spain outside of the larger cities and towns. The majority of people depend upon butane gas bottles to feed their hot water, their cooking and their heating. And it's the colour of these butane bottles, which are quite large, about 12 and a half kilos of gas. It's the colour that relates to the butane fly. Today we're going to tie it uh, with a fluorescent orange floss and cover it with a translucent pearl mylar. It's a fairly simple tie and we'll get straight into it. Uh, I've got a size 16 hook with a 2.8 silver bead. Let's uh, set the hook. It's a, a great uh, attractor um, when it's used on the top uh, as a top fly, but it also can catch uh, fish in its own right. The, um, the rainbow trout in particular are keen, not only on this, but on the colour, I think. They're very, uh, very keen on orange. Right, I'm going to tie in uh, the tail and the tail is uh, medium pardo coq de lion. Uh, the amount of fibres, well, five or six. Uh, you don't need that many. Uh, size 16 is quite a, a small nymph in terms of perligons. So let's just tie that in. Uh, you don't want the tail too long. That's about right. Go down. To the tail. Now I'm going to tie in the uh, the pearl mylar. Right. Just trim off these uh, ends of the CVC. Let's build it up a little bit at the end here. Right, I'm going to put a, just a little bit of super glue uh, on there to secure the wrap. Don't need a lot. And uh, when you're doing these turns, you can overlap them because, as I say, it's translucent and it doesn't affect the uh, the fluorescence of the orange floss coming through. In some ways, the uh, the mylar stops it being in your face, as you might uh, as you might say, or as the trout might find. Trim off that mylar. Right, I'm going to tie in some black thread so that I can put a uh, a collar. On this. Just get rid of that. Yeah. Get rid of the excess black. Build up the colour. Uh, we're on to this uh, illusion again of the uh, of the thorax cover using the black thread. Let's tie that off. And trim off the black thread. So the fibre there, see if I can get rid of that. 
Right, I'm now going to coat this with uh, a UV varnish, a thin. This is Loon. Don't need a lot. Give that a zap. You can see from the UV light the fluorescence of the uh, of the floss. As I say, the, the pearl just dampens it down a little bit. Give it a little coat. Up. So can't get rid of those little ends there. There we go, and there you have it. A simple polygon tying. I hope you enjoyed that. If you are not a subscriber, please consider being so. And I'll see you in the next video. Bye.